All right, guys, as promised, I got a video coming up, but X Tool has made my job a little harder. So it took me a few more minutes to get everything set up. But I promise you, by the end of the day, you're going to have a video of the best, most sound, proficient way to make tumblers with the X Tool F2, despite the fact that they could have done better. But let me show you the progress, but I can't give you all the details. You're going to watch the video for that. All right, so I've got it working on a tumbler that's wrapped with some painter's tape, a little cheat there for you guys that haven't ever seen it. I'm just testing the design to make sure that it's gonna work out like I want it to. But the problem is X-Tool designed this machine where there wasn't enough range of motion to get the uh, focus set by attaching it to the base like you can on the uh, F two ultra and some of the other machines so i had to do a little work around but never fear guys i came through for you i've got a fix for it and i'll share it with you in the long video that will be coming here soon so i am really digging the magnetic setup the ra3 is definitely an advancement uh it's bigger it's taller it, it's just it's it's better but with the smaller machines, what X-Tool failed to do, probably because when they designed it, they were thinking ultras, you know, and bigger. When they designed it, the base of it, the part that connects the chuck to the platform, it's about three quarters of an inch too tall to sit on top of the burnt bed and be able to focus. So you have to put it underneath the machine. And now you got, instead of having a nice fixed base, solid steady you know making rapid movements you know possible to be able to turn out tumblers quicker now you gotta fiddle with it and pray that you don't get it misaligned so i had to fix that for them first before we could make the video but the video will be here soon i've got the fix worked out and we're gonna call it code name bigfoot so go tell steve i named it after him it's gonna be called the bigfoot adapter so <laughs> stay tuned guys video soon